You gotta hit that, that notification bell, carnal. Join the notification gang, carnal. The roughest, toughest gang in the whole YouTube yarda, homeboy. What's good, y'all? What's handing with my YouTube family? All my subscribers, I appreciate every single one of y'all. For the new ones that ain't subscribed yet. What you waiting on, player? It's free. It don't cost you nothing. You ain't got to enter your debit cord. You ain't got to go down to the welfare office and wait in line for your food stamps like you used to have to, man. Come on, let's go. As many of us already know by now, Swifty Blue was arrested. He took the cops on a high-speed chase, invading, pursuit, felony, invading, gang enhancements, uh, felony in the possession of a firearm, all that, right? All that. He even crashed the low when, when you feel me, when he got arrested. He, he That's how he got caught because he went on the high speed and crashed. And yeah, man, but now he's bailed out. He did bail out. For those that don't know, Swifty Blue bailed out like the next day. You know, he got the money too, so why not, right? But to my understanding, he does have numerous other firearm possession charges in his past so and it's not looking good with that and as well as a uh, a crash a high speed if he had anyone in the car with him they're gonna charge him a felony as well for that person being injured in the car while he was driving you know it's just felonies on top of felonies you guys know how they do it in that courtroom man you guys know how them people play bro they just stack charges on top of charges on charges well swifty blue most likely might have to do a little bit of prison time him and Money sign Swage. Swage's locked up right now. He had to turn himself back in. And it looks like to me, from what I've been seeing from his people on what they've been posting, is that Swade may have to go do some prison time as well. These two are some of the uh, most popping Southern California Hispanic artists right now. Especially Swade, man. Shout out Swade. I fuck with dude music. And they might have to go do some prison time in the middle, in, in the height of possibly the height of their career. Where their their career is finally seeing an incline is finally taking off, and now you gotta go sit down and do do this prison bit when you're supposed to be on the road getting show money, man, selling out concerts or or little venues, whatever the case may be, getting some money from from your lyrics, getting man YouTube money, Apple money, motherfucking Spotify money, Pandora money, and all you know you can still get that, but. A lot of these independent artists, a lot of their money comes from doing shows. And matter of fact, I don't even think Swade is independent anymore. He signed to Atlantic Records. And that's, man, for even him, that's even more of a, a, a sock to the stomach. Because, like, bro, you're signed to a major label, Atlantic Records. And now, instead of being with this big old record label, now you have to go sit down and go to prison. That shit ain't cool. I could just imagine how that would feel, man. Like, ugh. Like, you know they had plans, you know they had tour dates, you know they had an agenda on what they wanted to do, right? And all that shit just comes to immediate stop. It's like when you're out there pushing right, when you're out there, you know, doing your thug this, you got all this fast money coming in, right? And then just like that, when them motherfuckers kick your dough in, all that shit gone. You stuck in intake, you stuck in that pod, like, fuck. You thought you were moving right. You thought you were moving smart. You thought you were being smart. But nah, man. It's them motherfucking people's job to watch your ass, bro. Now you in that intake. Now you in that pod sitting there like, fuck. Man, I never thought I'd be back in this motherfucker. Fuck, they got me. They got me, bitch. Damn, who told? Who said what? Who did what? Now, I don't know what Swade and Swifty Blue got going on. But obviously... Flashing guns in your music videos while you're already documented gang member, you already have felons, you know what I'm saying, possibly already on parole or probation, it's not a good look. It's not a good look, man. So to all the artists out there while watching, yes, you can be like, oh, they're props and they can't use it against you, they're props, this and that. Yes, that they, they most likely can't use it against you, right? They possibly can, depends on the situation. It's a case by case. But... You're just making yourself more hot. If they know you're on probation, they know you're a felon, they know you got prior gun charges, and you still want to do videos with guns, say they're props or whatever, anyways, like, you still want to do that shit? My nigga, that's dumb. Like, they, you're just making yourself more hot. I get it, you're an artist, you know, it's part of the music videos and all that, but you ain't got to have all the motherfucking guns in the music video, my nigga. 
You know what I'm saying? If your ops know what time it is, then the ops know what time it is. You know what I'm saying? Fuck the sucker side. You feel what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you ain't got to flash the hammers in the music video if the suckers, if, you know what I'm saying? If niggas know, niggas know. Keep the guns out the music videos, y'all. Keep the guns out the pictures off the gram because then people is for sure going to be on your ass. If they can't use that picture against you in court, they're just going to be on you. They're going to follow you. They're going to hawk you down, track you down, and they're going to eventually try and catch you slipping with one of those hammers on you like they did swifty man so just be careful out there and don't end up like these niggas is all i'm trying to say do not end up like these niggas and end up having to throw your motherfucking career away at the height of your career and go sit down for a prison bit man don't nobody want to go to prison nigga fuck that hit that like button hit that subscribe button it's that kid and i'm gone